Today guys is a very special day. We have a guest here uh, doing a washing with me. Uh, washer crazy. It's not the last washing. Um, we're going to be doing another meet up hopefully soon. Not too sure when. Um, but yeah, we're going to do the today. We're going to do the Hot Point 9530, the Cassata, and the Mina W562. We all know the A3060 is out of action. So keep yourselves tuned in, watch in HD because you are watching Florence Ballad A3060, the channel made in loving memory of the original Supreme Florence Ballad and Hoover's first 1100 RPM washing machine, the A3060 Electronic 1100. Guys, to start off, we're using the Cassata by Hot Points. Should I be able to shove it all in or something? Uh, yeah, I'll just do it in slow. I'll just check, I've got to check all the pockets though. I always do all that. that, that they won't run, will they, when nah, you put it into... I do all, I do all sources. God, this is my most used side on this machine. Uh, look at that tissue in there. That will not have been good. <laughs> yeah, my grand, you know, my grandma has had that issue as well. Mom's and and I get really times. annoying and my grandma becomes really annoyed when that happens. Mom has done it so many times. And then I have to get her DCA4 Dyson and hoover it all out. Oh, cooking apron, is it? No, sw swimmies, isn't it? Yeah, that's all it is. Oh no, should I? Wait, yeah. is that trousers? Yeah. No, it's a machine can take more than what for a, that what, from a 4.5 kilogram. No, that's actually, this is five, I think it's 5.5 5 kilogram. I swear it was a 4.5 kilogram drum, that one. 4.5 is the... Maximum. It's the, that's the Aquarius 9.5, I think it is. Is it? And the WM range after. Check. And obviously Ecos takes in water from, from the... the heat, um, yeah, doesn't heat, doesn't heat it up. Yeah, and I know Program J Quick Wash that um, takes. Um, it's that's basically an economy quick wash. Yeah. Yes, and it, it just take... and it will do. That's where it does dual turns in in one direct. In this the, does the it as well. After pro, just before it does the spin, it will do the the there double direction tumblers. All right, is that enough? Yeah. All right. First of all, let's get doing personal power drains for this one. And some comfort Hello. pure. That's the combination. I'll see. I'll sit that in the drawer. Lime scale prevention <coughs> tablet. Yeah, exactly. I normally put it in the drawer so it goes. You know, right. trying to get that yeah, on. that's a stiff one. So, how much would it come to when it comes to? You, would, you can do a full thing for that one. I always do full. Is that the last mat? Oh, that's the last bit. I don't think there's any more in that. No, that's all. all right, that's there fine. we are. End Give of the personal shake. power gems. And all finished. That's the last of the personal power gems, folks. There you are. Stick it on top. Of the... In the back. Yeah, top or low back of the drum. They don't say close it, but there. Uh, so, no, something else different. Mine's got a black, like you know, rubber. Something that's to be green. And then one um, cap for. See this as well. So you can change that. Liquid, so a liquid, 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 liquid. That's from a W. That did, this didn't come with it. So I found one off of that WD sixty one. I'll put it in there. In the scrap, did you? Yeah. And then in you go. That's a love doing on my WM fifty one. Yeah, that's glorious. That is. Right, okay, so we're going to program number D with Econ no um super instant time saver and then yeah, wait. Wait for it and hey, go. here we go. Filling hot water only that does. But finally the A3060 fills with cold and hot on a system. Oh does it? Don't understand why. Well at least that's the personal power gems all done now, isn't sure, it? Sure. I think that's a fun machine to use, though. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'll be doing. I'm going to put in. Um, You're going to put put something into. I might put tape underneath the wheels to try and balance it out a bit because it's the front two haven't got nylon covering on them. Yeah. It'll take a while to fill. It'll do a lot of top up fills. Do you never remember this, right? You never remember the Cassata? No, I don't remember the Cassata. No, but. I can remember If my... you guys remember, uh, Washer Crazy had uh, his gran had a WM63P, Polar White. That's right. With it. Three other people have got one, though. Uh... Optima 232's got one. Home Laundry Centre 800 got one. Yeah. And a guy that I know called Kai Grant, 1234, he's now got one. Oh, did he? He's got a May 2000 model, so Jaws a really late model. Oh, who can that be? Thank you. 
Oh, we did like two stages and here Jehovah's we go. Witnesses come, but they always come around this at all. That sound brings back memories. Yeah, it does. It's got different mo different sounding motors for the 953 It's not got like growl. It's got a hum. It reminds me, because Mark, we had the WD um like twenty something we did um as a, a as a youngster, yeah, we had a washer dryer. That's got more pauses in between um tumbles. Yeah. Is that because it's cotton? Yeah, on, the, on my, the rinses my, it doesn't turn off every tumble, it does about five tumbles per rinse I think. Yeah, because my grandma always used the program F Coloured Synthetics 50 when she always used to do her laundry. My grand used, well, on the first edition models there is no program K. Isn't there? It go program J is machine, this is what I'm going to do, because the first edition doesn't have silks and printed acetates. Doesn't it? It's got a hidden section on the dial between G and H. And I think the WM61 um, range didn't have um, the didn't only had a program J at um, like you know walls, didn't it? Yeah. No. Yeah. No, WM61. Or didn't it not have? Quick does not button? have. It doesn't have these two options. I don't think. Time saver and thingy. I don't think it's got, I think it's only got two. I think it's got only, yeah, I think it's only got economy and rinse hold. The 61 and 62 have only got two options, and it's yeah. the 63 and 64, and the 65 yeah. that have got f four options. There's more pauses in between. There is. I do like Now, this is fitted with the original timer of a double, because when it came, it had, it had a later one, like what the, the Creedum models use. Yeah. Where it did, it did that extra burst on the spin. What's that? So, like... So you know your grand's one would do 400 RPM, then, then it goes 500 and ramp up. Yeah, slowly. These ones, they are heating stage now. They are so here goes the slow tumbles. progressive tumbles. And another fill up. Could you actually, like, if you were to do this, like prime it with the hot water tap? Could, whatnot. yeah. Could do it. But um, obviously you want, you want to give it the full... I, um, only let the, I want the heating element to work on this machine. Yeah, so you, when they get ready for store, uh, sent off to storage and whatnot, isn't it? In Australia, it? I'll probably get a water heater. Oh, that'd be lovely. That's my bedding there. No, that's my bedding there, and Mum's bedding's over there. But I, even though Mum tells me to do it on sixty, I'll do it on ninety-five. Oh, uh, so we'll do a boil wash. Um, yeah. In the let's we'll do a boil wash for the next cycle. Yeah. Wondering who's the hot the 953 or the Miele. Let's go to the 9530 next, 95, so I can yeah. get my hot the hot point range out of the way. And don't worry, I have got a spare um you know a memory card, oh, so I fine. can top up let change up my things later. Right. Okay. I'll just pause and. Not just yet. Now, oh, he, there heat retaining stage. Look how quick he and she gets onto the heat retaining stages. So it basically heats back up to 60 now. Yeah. Love that sound. Yeah, and that's very nice, delicate, mute, like gentle that's tunnels, like. isn't it? That's why I do like the WM range, though. They, mm. This range. So, yeah, my cousin John and Ellie, they've got um, the LG Direct Drive um, 9kg6 motion turbo wash system. Um, washing machine that I saw. Is that one with like the black door screen? On the it? black door screen, and it's got like the silver digital dial, and it's yeah, got nice. touch sen and it's got touch screen buttons. It has not like a type liquid, it's just maybe like touch buttons. It has. The only thing I love about Hot Point is how the seal creases on them when the, when the drum goes, the suspension goes down. Yeah, it's like buckling it, isn't it? The A thirty six has got real. That's got a real tough door seal that has. Yeah. And then when it comes to unplumbing it, it's going to be a bit of... Paul, I, what I do is I... I kick, I open the door, I just grab by the drum, and it, as long it. as I lift it up, I get it onto the two rollers at the back and, and it, just pull and then it's easy to roll out. Otherwise, if you drag it on its feet, it makes a really horrible screeching sound. Oh, that's awful, isn't it? The good thing about this machine, though, why I like the fact it has adjustable feet, if it's unlevel, I can do anything, but these I can't. If, if that's unlevel... And a lot of those things, like, you know, if you get them on a certain, like, places, if you, when you're trying to adjust the feet, you can get a carpet burn, you can get a yeah. carpeted floor, some sort. Because this one, you've got the foot, and then it's got a locking ring above it, and mm -hmm. you just scroll that down, and it basically stops the foot from... Mm -hmm. The meter is easy to move, because I've put washing up looking under the feet, yeah, so exactly. I just drag that machine out. Yeah. But you might be able to see all the scratches on the floor before I've moved all the machines over time. Oh, right, it certainly causes wear and tear. Do you reckon before when you move, you might steam mop the... Um... Oh, we might do that. 
Yeah, because we've got the shark steam mop at home we have, which is nice. I never even demonstrated it when you ever came round when you came round to see me. Did you do a video of it? Have you? I did do a demo of a steam mop in action, but I don't remember when because um um I only did the demo. That fan you filmed was nice. Though. What was that? Was that, that ETC was one. It the blue one with the silver. Yeah, one. EFC. That was. It was. It was like a Japanese one, but it said made in Taiwan. It said so. I thought that means that's China pride. That is. Oh, and then there's a person to I love stuff. that drain. Look at that. It's creating like a whirlpool like in the sink, isn't it? You should see the sink when the hoover pumps out. That thing pumps out like jet. Like a yeah, jet pump it, or something. It gushes out like a tsunami into the sink. Oh, does That's it? That's a very powerful pump that model has. I've not actually had a... I've not used my personal power gems at all. Well, I don't know wash. Um, it's nice on these ones because the steam comes out the drawer when it's... That's the lovely, isn't it? The A36 does because it's got a vent pipe that goes out the back of the machine. Yeah. At least the sink will get a good clean, won't it? Yeah. But that will produce more water as it drains, wouldn't it? Spins, yeah. It's being spins. Still got the last little bit to go, isn't it? That's just what's like tripping up. The pump gets quite loud on this machine sometimes. I always remember where do the outdoor drains go, but I think it just goes into This that one big goes through a stack system into the wall, then it goes underneath. Into that big like inspection there you go, drain. Now. Distribution now. Any moment now. This is a distribution. Here we go. See what I like that they gradually climb into distribution. Yeah, that's not like a very nice smooth distribution or something, isn't it? People were surprised when I told them this machine's got an out of balance sensor. Because um, I would be not surprised if it didn't. If it's like very dangerously unbalanced. That's what I said. I said the thing is, I said, I said it only kicks in though if the load is like really unbalanced. So otherwise, that half the time will spin. Still, if the springs start twanging, then I know the machine isn't going to spin. But the trouble is, the only thing I don't like it skips the spin and goes into the rinse. And it will not do it unless you switch off and on. But and then, then when I do that, it messes up the timer. It only does one burst of the spin. And it is 500, and that's it. And then like on the um, like you know proper synthetics, like it will do like. 500, 500. When the ground time was rebalanced, did it used to do the indices at start balance? Like no, it, it would just go, it would just stop and I just switch it off and it would go up slowly. So this one does like an indices, you know how the inset ones go back? This one I don't it. really know actually how mine would do it. If anything, it's going to be my hooded sweater that knocks that out of balance. Oh, there's the classic hop to Trying to chug. In Australia, that would go chug. Yeah, that's my grandma's bad. one never that is, that is a little bit unbalanced. Oh, but then again, the, the oh suspension on this is really soft and bouncy. Like, compared to like... Any moment that should go... That will spin. That will, that's no way. It will not stop. No, that, will, that won't cut out, that's for sure, will it? Here we go. Oh, this is a little... A big sub slot. I'm surprised yeah. it's not even foamy either, is it? The next one it will do it. I love it. Kicks back into distribute. Oh, and the classic water jet. But what I like this machine, it lets the water pump out. The 9530 doesn't give time for the water to completely drain. So when it drains back into the rinse, there's water in the pump. I do love this sort of star spin. It always, I, I always miss my grandma's hot point. Here we go. Super Ince comes up to there. Yeah, that's just that that brings you like memories just like the hot point style. This one goes up to here. Yeah. It's it's going back another it's, it's it does it, yeah. A3060, halfway up the door. That's like logic style. The electrons feel higher. 
That's first rinse. First rinse out of four rinses. Yes, yeah, see, now I always thought they did three rinses. Well, that's on the synthetic cycle, they do three rinses. I didn't ever recall my Dominant 51 doing three rinses, uh, four rinses, so I must have missed it. I only thought the 9.5s did uh, four rinses. Well, I've, yeah, yeah, the 9.5s will do three rinses on the synthetics programs yeah. as well. Technically, they only do two, actually. But it's really? The cool down, go, the shot or rinse goes into the first rinse. Then there's a dish drain, second rinse, spin, spin final, final rinse, rinse, spin, and that's it, and then. Because even on the synthetic cycle, it will not do. Um, it will not it goes do just below. The, it just goes just below the. Because on my grandma's hot point, it will go a bit higher than that. I think I might need to clean up the pressure chamber on it. But anyway, that's looking like clear, well, maybe clear I'll, water. Maybe I'll tweak the pressure switch on that. Yeah. That water's clear coming out the drain, isn't it? I think that someone told me that the delicate tumbles are to reduce sight, but I was like. I don't, I don't think so, because I wonder if that was like, you know, for Hot Points design or something. It must be something to Hot Points. Yeah, probably the, the program design age or something like that. That's bouncing like mad. Was it, was it because the, um, the drums buckled or something like that? No, that's just because the suspension. Because I know in my grandma's you could be a singer. That's like buckled a bit. That one's buckled. Is that why it makes the string go? It buckles a little bit, does it? No, the reason that bounces around, the suspension's really soft on this model. So it's like it's designed for anti-shock, isn't it? That's state. That's quite stable. That in this spin might be different though. It's a bit like the 950 Pro. It looks balanced and ends up being not balanced. Yeah, unless it like you know mistakes it or something. No, it's a bit of back and forth movement. That means it might. It might pummel the cabinet just a bit, but I don't know. I've had it, not the machine. Here we go. That's quite stable, that is. Whoa, I love it. It's like a chug, 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 isn't it? Well, it's the sound of it going through the back of the drawer, I think it is. This only does 400 and 500 again. It's the next thing which climbs. Which will climb up to 800. I'm sure it's around 750 does. It's just below 800. It'll, it'll remain there for about 5 seconds and it slows down. Oh, for, forgot about the Cassata. You can also get the WD-61 in the Cassata. Can you? That's all. I definitely prefer the spin to the 9 miles. It sounds like you think people in 600 goes and then it goes. dropped down back to 500. Oh, and it's back down again. Very long coast now. If that was on this one to this one, then that would go straight to the first rinse. Yeah. That one, that's got a PCB in it, that's why you can wait. This one doesn't it's, care. It's just on a timer, so it will do whatever. And even like when Hot Point Crazy filmed um, the one with the cyclone, you know, Morrison's 2 one taps where it actually spun with yeah, water and drain. Yeah, just a Yeah, the block sump fill where he did. Was that what it was? The block was sump fill out. Oh, so that's why it struggled to drain, didn't it? And that's why it produced a, like a psychonic spin, didn't it? Yeah, well, I was thinking that was rubbish. Oh, because like the motor that you previously had, that had the FHP, FHP. motor. Did you save the FHP motor? Someone, someone bought it for thirty pounds oh. on eBay. I saw it on eBay. Someone, oh, did bought, they? someone bought it for thirty pounds. I was like, all right. Oh, well, who did? Come on, this guy up in near Cumbria or something bought it. Did they? Did you have to send it off by courier up to them? I don't know what machine you got it for, but I listed about probably over a hundred models that I could fit it to. I said the Electra, Creda, Jackson, Gala, and Hot Point models. Also oh, and um, what was his name? Um, Meta is Sigma, yeah. Sure, Sigma. He filmed it was it was a Clatronic, which was it's essentially a Creda, yeah, Creda with the same type of like design. There's a brand called Bowman, and they released WMA models out in Bowman. Um, that was the same like um, Kyle's Crusader tumble dryer. That was. They released. And then you had the Europa, which was again the Creda Renaissance tumble dryers, and yeah. the next spin. This is the fast one now. So that will climb up to just below 800. It might be 700, I'll have to look at the service manual and see what it says. Really? Then, then comes the super rinses after the, the deep level rinse. Oh um, yes, the lovely logic height style. Not logic, but... I have wondered, can you actually put it really high? But well, that would strain it really badly, wouldn't it, if you were to I think really these machines, these machines, you could fill them on 
so hard. Right to the very top. Neither you can't. I've tried it and it got to halfway and the pump kicked, kicked in. Oh, so that's what I mean. It's got overflow, overfilled sensor. That's it has what I was, yeah. That drum is swinging back and forth like mad, I can see it. Can you actually feel the cabinet moving? It's yeah, doing. I can see it. Oh yeah, I can just about feel it, yeah. yeah no, oh my it. god. That's gonna try and be balanced, isn't it? Don't cut out, yeah, that is on, that's gonna be unbalanced. And that will make it into the... Yeah, there you go, that is unbalanced. And that will make it into the, um, you know, the, the spins for 2018, oh. wouldn't it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, it's going brrr. Oh, if he gobsmacks me, it doesn't spin. I don't think it will. I'm going to back it up. I don't off. think that's going to spin. It look, that's too unbound. Back off if it does spin. There's no way it will spin that. You'll know it's. Dead in springs. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Oh my goodness me. That, oh, that twanged. Did you hear that? Yeah. God, sounded like it. When my grands did that, what? it would actually hit the concrete, like you hear the concrete go and clunk on the floor. This has done it. Yeah. I've had the weight hit the chassis of the machine while it's spinning. Yeah. I can't believe it's spun that. It would never do that. Yeah. This is going to vibrate if that was the final spin, wouldn't it? You're just going to go up to 750. Yeah, it's, it's pummeling the cabinet, isn't it? Oh, 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 hello. Right. It's okay, it goes a little sub. Oh, it's just a little, because I think it was unbalanced, wasn't it? Normally when it's unbalanced, that will in, probably encourage another yeah. like, water lock, wasn't it? But yeah, I love the ramp up. It's very it's smooth. Better. That's what I prefer to the Yeah, because our, our, like, our hot point would ramp up a bit faster up to 800. But yeah, I do like the smooth ramp up. Oh. But it's trying to. Yeah, it's oh just my gosh, look at that. Oh, you can hear the. Up there. But I love the smooth ramp down, it's very nice. I like machines that have spin stages. So, what are we going to put in the 9.5? Or are we going to put this one? Or put this one? It's not behind me or something, or this one. Well, one of the big ones. Oh my goodness. Oh, you can see by the shaky stuff. Oh my. That's that's the cabinet doing that. I thought it was the springs. Oh, I did hear the springs trying on that. Yeah, because when, when, when is the first one? Doink! No, no, I did that towel from the side. <laughs> oh yeah, where is that? Spring was... twang, what is this you doing? It's just heat expansion. Yeah. They're watching, I'll watch what it does. That's what my granny's um, WM63 did as well. But that will do the nice logic high water. But if it tight spins just right before it's drained, it will attempt to do a massive suds lock where it only gets to about 400 and come down again, it would. That's, that's crazy, that is. Yeah, that's why I nickname it uh, Cassata Crazy. <laughs> Yeah, instead of calling it hot point crazy. So I don't call this a WM60 here, I just simply call it the Cassata, because that's what it that's why I got it. I did I was wise I never would have got a WM63. I wasn't interested in getting out more, but because it was a Cassata, that's why I wanted that. You thought that would be rare. And even if you were to get like the Bowman or um or the I'm the uh, only collector who's got a Cassata model. Yeah, because uh, what's his name? Bolknocked boy from the Bow Bowman, which oh, again, as I say, it's it's essentially Crusader that it is. is. Yeah. Because the car drop once, that's just, that's like my Crusader tumble dryer, that is. Crusader are basically hot point. Yeah. But all Crusader... But it all uses, it uses Creed apart. Crusader are just... No, uh, hot point ones are just... They, all Crusader are, they're just a comic exclusive brand. Who are they? Who hot point, yeah. Because like Proline products... Proline, um, I think, are an exclusive uh, one. Uh, Curry's exclusive. No, comic exclusive. Because you have the Essentials um, Creed, uh, and you have the Cassette Curry's Essentials, which are the basic ones. They're like, Ves they're Vessel, they are. Are they? They're Vessel branded. Because like the Tesco's ones are the same as well, aren't they? When they're Tesco yeah, they're Vessel. too. Vessel, no, Bush. They are the Vessel Bush. Bush, I think it was. I don't like Bushes, they're an absolute pile of junk they are.
So that's going to produce a very nice high water level, isn't it? And this is fair rinse, isn't it? Fair so yeah, one more rinse off that, which would be the lovely Final. comfort. Do you know, that's what my granny used to use a lot. And when my auntie and uncle had their Nexus, they always used to use Net Comfort Pure and Personal Non-Bio. Because that's really like a really good combination of detergents, isn't it? So yeah. And I still remember that time on YouTube when Orclox Boy and Matter of Sigma destroyed a Samsung where they threw washing in it and it went mad. They did it to an AG, I think, as well. No, they did it to an AG. They also did it to an old... In did they do it to an old Indice as well, I think, I still remember as well. And that's when we're going... <laughs> oh, yeah, we're, reaching, we're reaching the... Where are we getting to? We just near to the, there, are we? Door seal. Reaching the bottom of the yeah. door seal. Have you also been like getting bills from waters? Because you know sometimes you we, get like, things like you're on water meters. And we're not on a water meter, luckily. We? No. Not, I don't think we are either. We just pay a fix. I know. I know. Chris Pierce says he's, his, his, he's on a water meter, so he has to save his water when he's doing it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that's the level there. Just, just, just below the. Bottom. Just below. Just below. The Here thing. we go. Yeah, lovely. So it's The guys on final intermediate spin. Oh, and then we're going to final rinse after that. With some comfort here, which is what I decided to use. That's some comfort, the best combination. Yep, as recommended on the packet. And recommended by Hot Point. Yes. Hot Point changed to Aerial. Into yeah, that's when that's when they had that one with Lionel Richie Easy it always used to have, which was nice. That was the WC965A, I think. No, the WC960, I think. No, it was, a, it was an aluminium model. Yeah, but it was. I love that one. It did. That was the best song ever. That's when they changed to Aerial. They changed to yeah, Aerial. Yeah, Hot Point recommends Aerial. Now Hoover are personal for mine, but when they went to the Electrons, they changed to Aerial. I think it was. Called. And what was that one? They used the 9534 with um, Persil Automatic Liquid, and what? they actually threw lots of. Someone threw the like young girl four. threw lots. Of, the women actually threw lots of. Mud and dirt in there and all kinds. There was a huge debate on what machine it was. It's a 9534. I think it was a 9534. Because, because it's got the mains indicator light. Oh, yeah, it must oh, have done. Oh god, here we go again. Oh uh, <laughs> my word. <laughs> Brace yourselves, isn't it? Oh, you can do it, go clunk and clunk. Oh. Something in the pump. Here we go. Oh, it moved! Yeah. Hey! I thought I could literally... Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, I thought it could literally... I thought it nearly sounded like something was in there. Oh, it's fine. Yeah. So that's what... And sometimes, you know, if you block the pump, you can do it making like a tick... Like a, like a static noise, and it's like going... Hmm, don't know what that oh. is for the pump. Oh, that's... No, that's the zipper. That's not... Oh, I know what it could be. I think it's the. Is it the could, be, could be the string from my hoodie. Oh, was it? One time on the 953, it got, it got pulled through the drum and hit while it was spinning. Didn't it like buckle it or something? It, 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 it ripped the hoodie thing while it was spinning. Well, didn't you have to throw it away in the end or something? No, it was, it was fine. And again, up to 800, isn't it? Popular machine on my channel. Yeah. The Sata. Everyone's like a lovely. No edition. one expected me to get. Them. They they didn't think I was going to go. They didn't think what what was that going to be, wasn't it? And then boom boom boom, there it was, wasn't it? Lo and behold. The big reveal was the A36. If that. you want to get the WM62, is that the WM62? Is that 1100 as well? Is that 12,000? 
Oh, you just to get the map the two like you know different. I did want to get. I did want to get a 61, 62, 63, and sixty four all in the line. All collection and, and have them all go at the same time on a spin. Oh, that's that would be awesome. Because they all do the same. It's just like you know when I when I went to BHF, oh, um, I found the WM sixty two and the WM sixty three. Was it WM sixty one? Oh, you did get a Sovereign 61 in there. Yeah, but I think they both had FHP motors, didn't they? No, they had GEC ones, they did. The both of them that I yeah. filmed. I knew this had an FHP motor when I saw the drum ring was silver, and I was like, that's definitely going to have a replacement motor. And I, I was like, oh, I was like, are you kidding me? I was like, oh. But luckily, I ordered one off eBay, that's what, that's what I wanted. Oh, that'd be a pity, wouldn't it? It came with carbon rushes in there, that was the best but, thing. Well, that's the main thing, at least it had it, didn't it? Well, I did. So the first that motor, I took the brushes out of this machine. Oh, did you? Is that when when it bit the dust or something? Because um, I think you had to take the carbon brushes out of the 954 when it bit the dust, didn't it? Last year at this point, did it? Yeah. Carbon brushes ran out. Oh, right. So did you get those night um, online? Did you? Got them from Amazon. Too. And you said when it sounded, you said it sounded like a WMA on just the brushes. Ben breaking, in. yeah, breaking them in. They got bent in basically. So yeah. They would have sounded like that brand new. That's how they would have sounded brand yeah, new. Yeah, when you bought this machine brand new in the in from, from the store or somewhere where you got it from, didn't you? Oh, I believe that. I remember when those were in Curry's. I remember seeing the last of the WM range in Curry's. Hey. Right on cue, I did that. <laughs> Final spin. You know what's weird about this model though? It doesn't say Aquarius 1100. I don't understand why. No, it, it's missing that, isn't it? Final spin, frames. Hmm. Oh yeah. Oh look at that. It's, it's a bit like coffee foam on the top, isn't it? Look, there's little bubbly foam mounting. Oh, right, let's see what it's going to be. I always remember this time I think you used to go to standpipes and all that. Yeah, we never had a sample. We always did it in the sink. Yeah. But what was it? Was it with this? This machine you had to tape the hose pipe down. Yeah, and because it, I put a 1.5 meter hose, it couldn't put over, but I put, these all got 2.5 meter hose. So we're going to have to tape it when we... No, um, just put it around the sink now, because I've put a longer hose on it. Oh, have you? Let's see now. Oh, yeah, that's going to do. Oh, that's going to do. Oh, yeah, that's going to do. Oh, yeah, that's going to do. That will make glug, I hope, that sink. Probably will. Because it's clear water. Again, that's nice and smooth, again. Oh. Speak too soon. Oh no, it doesn't look that bad, actually. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh my, no. It's, it's, tr it's pranking. Lovely and smooth. Wow, big water lock. But that's lovely and smooth, that is. Here we go, he's the best part now. Get ready for it. Get ready, Hotpoint fans. There goes the gluck. The smooth ramp. Oh, the sun is going smooth. Oh, look, that pipe's shaking. Yeah, well, it shakes here. Sheet shaking at the side. And it's trying to like, water lock again, but it's not quite. And the best ramp, the slow, fast, like ramp up to full speed. The one thousand, then three minutes, one thousand, and then right up, the thirty seconds, and then right up to the, the very top. Oh, that's 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 that's
Today, this was this is the smoothest one I've ever captured or something. And the pump doesn't feel as growling as much. You know? I replaced the pump on this, I did. Oh, did I took you the need original to clean one because the original one on it was so loud it drowned out the motor. Oh, did it? That's that like pump out now, isn't it? Anti tangle ends. I think this was the WD-61, it tumbles and it does a thermo spin and then goes into the drawing cycle. Mm. That's the first time you captured a smooth spin on the final spin, haven't you? This machine is totally the opposite, though. It does unbalanced final spins all the time. Whereas the, the 9.5 would do unbalanced spins no matter the what. Think, I think for that one I'll do a half though, because it's only going to be a half. Oh no, we'll be bedding in that one, I think. Oh yes, that, that'd be good. See how it copes with unbalanced bedding if it knocks up or something like that. We'll do a boil wash on that one. Yeah, give it a good clean, in it. Not 
yet. Any moment, hopefully? Just gonna wait for the final click, and now we're just gonna wait for the door to click. That's it, guys. So that's the Cassata done. We'll move on to the 9 by 30 now. After that one, and there's the A36. I did keep it out. 